Dear students, today I am going to solve the question number 44 from the kinematics SC Berman. This is most demanding question over the internet and most demanding for every student. In this question, what is given basically, I want to solve it by very easy method. There, there, there may be so many methods to solve it, but best method I am giving you. Benches of Gallery Cricket Stadium I have shown over here. Its width is 1 meter and height is also 1 meter. Height is also 1 meter. And a batsman hit the sixer with angle 43 degree and the initial velocity is 35 meter per second. It means it will follow the projectile motion. If it follow the projectile motion and 110 meter from the batsman, this distance is given and 1 meter high above the ground, batsman hit the six. This is the given in diagram. Now, in order to calculate it, first you need to calculate the equation of trajectory. Let, this is the trajectory. This is parabolic in nature. In projectile motion, general equation of projectile is that is equation of parabola y is equal to x tan theta minus of g x square 1 by cos square theta. I will write here secant square theta and divided by u square. This is the equation we already know in case of projectile. Now, when you make another equation of the slope here, let I am taking this portion only. This is 1, this is 1. It means this is 45 degree. This is 45 degree. Then, 10 45 degree you can write 10 45 degree that is 1. It means slope of this particular line is 1. You need to calculate let this point having coordinates x comma y and this point having coordinate you know that is x is 110 comma y is 0 here. When you have two coordinate, I will calculate the slope. Let us see 1 is equal to y2 minus y1 that is y, y1 is 0 divided by x2 minus x1 that is x minus 110. And finally, equation you can write that is x minus 110. This is the equation of straight line which I have drawn over here. Then I have to replace y x minus 110 is equal to x 10 you have to use a tricky triangle here 3 4 5 53 means 10 53 means 4 upon 3 that's why you have to put here 4 upon 3 minus half g suppose at 10 and x square as it is secant square theta that is 1 by cos theta cos is 3 by 5 that is 5 by 3 whole square divided by u is given that is 35 square of 35 you have to write here. You know you will get the quadratic equation here. Whatever quadratic equation you get you have to solve it that is x minus 110 is equal to 4 x upon 3 minus 5 x square 35 square is 25 4 3 12 12 25 into 25 upon 9 and finally you will get the quadratic equation when you solve the quadratic equation here you will get some value of x here and that value of x can also solve value of x may be something just like uh, you can say 115.4 meter you should solve it I am just approximately writing this value. How do you know in which step it will hit? In order to solve that we do one more thing that is if there is 110 to 111 the 110 and 111 till this it means that is the first step 
and 111 to 112 that is second step 112 to 113 that is third step 113 to 114 that is fourth step 114 to 115 that is fifth step now 115 to 116 our result will lie between 115 to 116 that's why it will cover six step of the stair this is the answer dear student try to solve the value of x approximately and